Hey, welcome back to the channel and to another video. Now today is walk around day again and I'm really excited to share this camper with you today because this is a really rare base vehicle. So make sure you hang around until the end of this video because I'm also going to be handing over this camper to a very excited customer and I'm really looking forward to seeing his reaction. So make sure you hang around and let's get started with the walk around. Okay, so here we are. Welcome to our most recent BW camper. And like I said, this is a very rare base vehicle in that this is the bay green color, uh, which they've actually stopped making now. So BW don't make this color anymore. And it's also a long wheelbase van and it's 150 brake horsepower manual engine. So this is a very, very rare van. And we were very lucky to find this for the customer. Uh, so this is a VW T6.1. It's on a 72 plate. So it's a 2022 van. Uh, it's a Highline uh, model, okay, and it's had our full uh, Platinum conversion package. In fact, it's had the Platinum Plus package. Uh, it's had a couple of extras on here. Uh, so it's had the 20-inch uh, uh, Wolf Race alloys and tyres. They're brand new alloys, brand new tyres. Uh, we have lowered the van uh, by 40 millimetres uh, as usual. We've put on the gloss black uh, side steps uh, on both sides, as you can see. Uh, because it's had the platinum package we have put on this remo awning rail which runs down the passenger side and fits most awnings and canopies um, uh, but i think you'll agree that this van this color the green looks great with the black trim uh, this van is also a, a tailgate van okay so this makes it even even more rare uh, more difficult to find um, and we just have we just don't see this color of van around anywhere um, so what i want to do now is just open up the tailgate and just quickly show you the back of the van um, so this is the back of the rock and roll bed. Uh, I'll talk through the, the colour of the units uh, once we get inside the back of the van. So you've got a, a cupboard at the back there, at the back of the wardrobe, which is a decent size uh, cupboard for storage. Uh, and then the cupboard below that uh, is also a decent size there, and you've got the leisure battery stored in there. But the biggest um, storage space in the van is under the rock and roll bed. So that goes right to the front of the bed, uh, plenty of storage space. Uh, and with the rock and roll, it goes right to the back of the van. So I'd love to know what your thoughts are on this long wheelbase in, in uh, bay green. Uh, we love it. We think it looks absolutely amazing. Um, now, the roof is uh, a black canvas uh, with a black roof top. And this is a scenic canvas. OK, so that, that um, canvas actually pulls right back. Uh, I've not done it today because it's very, very windy. But that, that canvas does pull back. Uh, you've got privacy glass windows all around. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll just jump in the back now uh, and just talk through uh, the internal spec. Uh, so like I said, this has had the Platinum Plus package, so it's had the van shades blinds, which in this van are called Slate. The furniture colour is the light grey gloss, which is a very light grey. Uh, it's got the light grey graphite seats, okay, with the ribbed style and then the green stitching to match the van. So we've actually matched this stitching very closely to the bay green uh, in the VW logos and the stitching. Uh, and this is a really, really nice colour, this, this uh, poultry. It's a little bit lighter. Uh, you've got the double gas burner and the cold running water sink, as usual, and then two decent sized locker cupboards, which are a little bit bigger because of the long wheelbase. Uh, with the electrics, you've got the two 240 volt sockets and the two USBs, and then also the diesel heater, as it's got the platinum package on it. Uh, the customer went for the um, solid oak worktops and table, uh, and then this flooring is called Dolphin. Uh, and then we've kept the double seat in this van, so it's got a double, it's got a double swivel, which slides right out into the van, right up to the table. Uh, and then that slides back into position, which makes it really, really easy to swivel when it, um, because it slid out into the van, you've got a lot more space. Uh, and it also means you can you sort of pull the seat right up to the table, as you can see. Um, so if you just step into the front of the van, when the seat is pushed forward, you've got a nice big storage space uh, in the front when you are parked up with the double seat. Whereas with the single, that stays in its normal position. Uh, we've matched all of the upholstery at the front with the rock and roll bed. So it's the graphite, again, the graphite ribbed with the green stitching. And if we just step into the driver's area, this is, a, like I say, a Highline van. It's a 150 manual. It's got a, a rear parking camera. And then again, we've matched all of the front seats uh, to the rock and roll bed, as I said. 
Uh, it's got the captain driver's seat uh, at the front there, which looks absolutely great. Okay, so I'll just take a little step back so you can see it from a distance. So please do let us know what you think to this uh, color, what you think to the spec. Do you like the bay green? We'd love to know. Uh, it's very difficult to find these. So if you do want a bay green van, it's very difficult for us to source these, but we can try and find one if you did want one. Uh, but we're really, really happy with how this van uh, has turned out. So let us know in the comments. Okay, so that's it for the walk around. Now I'm just on my way now to Huddersfield train station uh, to go and pick up Mark and his wife. And I'm going to be taking them to our sales office and revealing the camper to them. Now I've not actually met Mark before, so Mark used our source and convert service. So we helped him source this van and then we've worked with them to choose all the spec and the extras. And they actually live in Lincolnshire and we've actually worked with them remotely, so we've never actually met them. So today's the first time we're going to meet them and then also reveal the camper to them. So I'm just on my way to the train station now. Uh, I'll check back in with you when I get to the train station and we can see how excited they are. And then once we get back to the sales office, I'll check back in with you and we can see what their reaction is when they see their camper for the first time. So I will see you at the train station.